Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we are going to do an OSINT video. I haven't done an OSINT video in a while, but Crashwire has been posting some pretty fun OSINT challenges on his Instagram. And I highly suggest you go follow him and and participate in these. They're a lot of fun. This video will kind of help you with some of that. This particular OSINT is geointelligence, so we'll be finding a location. So to get started, let's look at what the challenge says. So it's an OSINT challenge. The scenario is a threat actor we've been pursuing has been utilizing dead drops and covert in messages. We intercepted the following message with a photo in the next slide attached. The access code is painted nearby. Look for a numbers beneath for every EB and RR. The access code number format is X-X-XX. It kind of looks like a date. And then in the next image, it will be the image that we have. So this is the only image he gives us, and we are to find this location. To do this, the screen here is actually a cell phone. So what we're going to do is we're going to take and put this image into Google Lens. Once we do that, we're going to focus it on something unique about the photo which would be all of this um, graffiti this bridge type everything and we instantly see that there's a couple of images that come up we can see that this one here by reddit that's not quite the same bridge but this one this one and this one that all looks to be the same bridge and a lot of cities with this graffiti stuff will end up deleting um, or it'll end up painting over graffiti and it'll be repainted and repainted and repainted. So there's a good chance we're just looking more for the bridge than we are the graffiti. So let's take and we can look at TripAdvisor to see what comes up. We'll visit that website. So boat tours and water sports. Boat tours and water sports in Austin. Okay, so maybe Austin, Texas. Before we go look at Google, let's look at a couple more. Let's look over here at this Instagram. We can visit it. Instagram makes it kind of hard because now I'd have to go through this lady's Instagram to figure out uh, more about it. Let's see. Let's look at this TripAdvisor, see what it says. Again, Austin, Texas, so there's a good chance what we're looking for is in Austin. See, are there any other photos of it? That looks to be about it. So let's go ahead and go back a little bit and let's just expand to see more of the bridge and see if something else comes up. So this one here by Drake Photography doesn't quite look like it. But this one looks a lot like it, and it's another Austin result. So let's look at it. So Lamar Boulevard Bridge, Austin. Okay. So let's go look for this Lamar Boulevard Bridge. So we'll go ahead and move over to looking on computer rather than... I'll get this out of the way. Uh, we'll leave it in frame so we can kind of see what we're looking for. Let's 
Okay, so let's go. Lamar Boulevard Bridge, Austin, Texas. So we have a bridge. Now let's go down to see where all we can see. And look, just perfect. There's a place that goes underneath the bridge. Well, looking at it, this, oh, there it is. This bridge doesn't look like it. But if we turn around, this bridge looks more promising. Let's get a little closer. So we see something. Oh, EBRR. Let's go back to the prompt. Forever EB and RR. The access code is underneath it. So there we have the access code 2917. So that was pretty simple to find. He has it listed as hard. And if you don't really, there, there weren't as many results whenever you reverse image search this. And, and that is what this is called. This is called a reverse image search. But from that, we were able to pinpoint this location just from this original photo. This is just the tip of the iceberg in OSINT. We did the OSINT with Wi-Fi the other day. There, I guess it's been months now. And now we've got this OSINT. Crashwire did post kind of his own tutorial on it. And let's go through it and see how he differs from what we just did. It should be very similar, but there may just be little bitty differences. So here's his walkthrough. Step one, screenshot it, put it in Google Lens. That's what we did. Step two is search the room. Okay, so he, he did see this image. He liked this image. So he used the first Instagram image and just dug through it a little deeper. You can see that that was taken at Ladyburg Lake. So let's go back over here and just Ladyburg Lake, Austin, Texas. So where is that? Okay, so Ladyburg Lake, I'd consider it more of a river, but it is this full area. So that narrows it down a lot. Let's see what he does next. Pretty sure it's the same we did. Google Maps, Ladyburg Lake, that's what we just did. Switching to Google Street View shows that we can use a ground level view of the lake or river. Start searching all the bridges. Search the bridge for access code. Looks like the correct bridge. Turn around a little bit, and there you go. So yeah, quick, short little video about a little OSINT. I'm gonna try to post some of these uh, challenges in my Instagram as well. Me and Crashwire have talked a little bit about it. He's gonna do it one week, and I'm gonna do it the next week. Obviously, there may be some gaps in between that as well, just depending on how many of these we can actually do without giving away our location too much. So yeah, come follow me on Instagram for this kind of stuff. Go follow Crashwire. He's done a handful of these now. So, okay, let's just take a quick look at Crashwire's Instagram and see if we can look back at some of the ones he's done in the past. He has a whole folder of them. So he did a space OSINT. And as he does stuff like this, if he does some that I've never experienced or something new, then I'll do the same. I'll go ahead and make another video on it because I want to learn all this stuff as well. So there's a Discord. I'm going to have to go find that. So his first one was here. Bonus points if you name the establishment. It was a little simpler. Here's his third one. Has more details to it. I may not be get this creative with it. I'll try to, but this isn't my 
forte. This is definitely something he's been pretty good at. Here's another one. Here's the preview, the one I believe right before this last one. No, okay, so this is still further back. Here's an, another one he did. One in, one in a location. Uh, these are all geo -int intelligence, I believe. Name and latitude, longitude of the establishment. <coughs> so, yeah. Again, it's just geolocating this location based off of this image. Here's another one. Okay, so you're finding, you're trying to find a specific camera. That's cool. That one I might have to go back and do and then report back on, make a video of. Another GeoInt. So this is the first one I started following him with. This is the first one I did, and it w it was it was a good one. I highly suggest if you're into into this stuff, go back through. He doesn't have the answers in this, so go back through and go ahead and just give it give them all a try. I have I know the answer to this one, and I know the answer to the last one. I'm gonna go back through and do some of the ones I haven't done yet either. Here's the most recent one. It's over. I'm posting the video now that it's over because I didn't want to, you know, give too much away before the challenge was over. So yeah, if you like this video, if you like geo intelligence, go ahead and go give Crashwire a follow on Instagram. He's posting a bunch of really cool stuff like that. He's in the war driving community. He's 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 in all of this. Uh, I've I've met him in person. He's a real cool guy. Also, follow my Instagram. I'll be posting more OSINT stuff as well. Until next time, we'll see you later.